Today's November 3rd, and uh, back in the same spot I was last night. Had that shooter buck come in on me about 2.30, and uh, ended up being a pretty good night. Saw six doe and three different buck. Came here this morning, and as I was uh, kind of getting situated, still before late of light, I thought I heard something, and uh, it sounded like a deer, so I'm obviously finished what I was doing. I'm standing there, standing there, and we had a pretty much full moon, and I could see a body coming from my left, come all the way around me, and then would have got right in front of me, probably about 30 yards, and so kind of wide open there. I got my range finder up, and I could make out, I'm pretty sure it was the shooter buck that I saw yesterday. So he was just kind of picking his way through here never knew I was here no nothing and uh, he come by about 30 yards and then he worked off the same way he worked off when I seen him yesterday afternoon so it was about 15 minutes before legal light so I obviously couldn't shoot him but it's cool to see that he's in here so hopefully he'll get a doe up and runner past the stand. Well it's a little after 10 and uh, I haven't seen any deer since probably, I don't know, 640, something like that. So I saw that, I'm pretty sure it was a shooter buck, uh, about 10, 15 minutes before legal. I could see him by the moonlight and just only when I looked through my rangefinder could I see his rack. And then shortly after that I had two phones come through, but I haven't seen anything since. So. I'm going to get down, today's election day, so I'm going to get down, swing by, check a couple cameras, and then go vote, and then eat some lunch and get back out. Uh, probably just going to come back to the same spot here, because I, if it is him, he went up into a point, in a little wood lot here, and I'm hoping, with seeing six doe here last night, that he'll just hang around, and I mean, it's a matter of time before one of them comes in estrus, and then... It should be wide open, so kind of just put my time in and hoping that things start to happen. Back in here on that big deer, I'm pretty sure I saw him this morning before legal light. Um, just barely make out the shape of his rack through my range finder as he walked past me like 30 yards. And he went right behind the camera here, and uh, there's a finger of woods that goes up in between two fields. I think he went up in there, if not, I mean, once he got out a little ways, I lost track of him because it's still dark, I was just seeing him by the moonlight. Either went out in there or he turned and went down the hill, but either way, pretty sure he's around this area, and last night I saw six doe, so hopefully one of those will come in heat and uh, he'll just start pushing him around, or he'll just get up and cruise and look for the first one, but fingers crossed. Better stand up and get ready. Yeah, I'm just.
new spot. And on the way in, I knew there was a scrape there last year from scouting. I threw a cell camera up there. And literally right now, one of the big bucks is standing there. I almost, I almost set up right there over that scrape. Now the wind's going back right to where that scrape's at. 